the left. Yes, what's up, man? No, I just had a couple of questions for Blossom. Um, it's not in really in relation to no uh, the Israelites, but um, I did see that he brought up a lot of them charts dealing with slavery. I just wanted to ask him, do he think that is he from Africa? Is he an African? Who are you talking about? I'm talking about Garfield. I'm asking Garfield. Garfield, do you hear the question? I'm African 100%. a matter of fact, my DNA says I'm 86%. Uh, average of 85% because I took several tests. But I am from West Africa, culturally, spiritually, every way possible. I'm from West Africa. Who, who are you, my brother? Who, who are you? I just introduced myself. So I'm saying, what do you? Are you a Christian, Muslim, African what? That's what I'm asking you. I'm an Israelite and I'm a Moor. Oh, okay. He's an Israelite and a Moor. Shalom. Shalom and Islam Shalom to you, brother. Islam, exactly. All right, but, go ahead. Um, I'm just saying, I don't take nothing literally. I take everything as a school of thought. Now, I, I honestly, a lot of stuff that he was saying, he's saying that a lot of information come from Europeans, right? But when you got black men such as Harvard Butler who write books saying a lot, that a lot of that stuff... Pseudo! Get out of here with that, bro. Hold on, let him talk, Garfield. Pseudo. Look, when you got a Sudo. black man... It's Pseudo! It's Pseudo! Butler talking about all the stuff that they found in America that was nah, 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 bro. You made, you made it, he made that up, and you're making it up right now. Let him talk, Garfield. Let me ask you another question. Let me ask you another question, Garfield. Garfield. Can you hear me, Garfield? Loud and clear, brother. Okay, let me ask you a question. Do you know that there's a pyramid in Brazil that's 3,000, that dates back to 3,000 BC? Did you know that? Um, yes, sir. I'm I'm quite aware of that. Okay, so all right, they they say that that pyramid is older than the one in Egypt, and this is not. So it, so, so hold on, hold on a second. So what what do you you say you gonna ask me a question? So can I respond? Huh? I all said, right, all right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Before we go anywhere, brother, I gotta test the skills to see if you are a real Hebrew. Do you <laughs> do you believe? Do you believe in the Bible from the beginning? To the end, that is it. No, absolutely not. I know, I, I know that the New Testament is bullshit. All right, so hold on. Hold on, brother. Hold on. Hold on. You're going too fast. You don't believe that the Bible is in its purest form from the beginning to the end absolutely and not. is the word absolutely of God. Okay, so absolutely not. Absolutely so now not. so now I see what Captain Tazoriak and them be saying. If you're not a part of ISUPK and the Hebrew mm -hmm. Israelites, you're not a real Hebrew. Yep. So so, um, brother, you just you just fucked up. Because if you're a Hebrew that believe in the word of God, you just told the world that you don't believe that your Bible is pure or that the brother, Bible is said, not the word of God. Letter, you put words in my mouth. First of all, we do know damn well that them Europeans act with tamper with all our, uh, with all our information. So you got to take what you can take out of it and let it apply to yourself. You don't take nothing literally that these people that gave you back. We don't, now let me ask, I'm going to ask Garfield one question, right? Because this is what, where I stand at. I stand that most of us in North America, maybe in Jamaica you might be African, but most of us in North America is indigenous to North America. We ain't come here on no freaking slave shit, and I don't care what articles you pull up. There's, there's, there's hundreds of pyramids in North America, and somebody built them, and these mongoloids don't even know about them. So now, well, that's that's a, that's a let me. Can I respond to you, my brother? Can I respond to you? Let me say one more thing. Let me say one more thing, and then he can respond. Now he say he's from. He say he's a Jamaican, right? Now, what sense do it make that say that that the Europeans brought you from Africa, brought you to Jamaica, and then took you back to Europe? When they came here, they seen black people and took you back to Europe. They never brought you from Africa and brought you back to um to Jamaica. You, the people in the Caribbean have always been here. And you know the Arawaks call themselves Indians. Why would the Arawaks that that call them, that look like Negroes call themselves Indians if they came in from Africa? All right, brother. Thank you, man. We gonna hey, let go hey, 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 thanks for thanks for that, brother. All I, all I'm gonna say is me. Um, Jamaica was a port to dish out. I, I don't know if a lot of people know this. The statistic says over 380,000 people came to America from Africa. A lot of folks don't realize that a lot of the slaves that went to America came from Jamaica. Jamaica, over, we have over a million slaves that came there. It was like a docking port to say, where are we going to send the slaves at? So, so my brother, 
I'm not going to get into that argument with you, but I do suggest that you subscribe to Dagger Squad, the YouTube channel. <laughs> you went, we went into it. We killed the cheat, whatever his name is. I'm not going to give him give him no shine. We murdered him the other night. We showed bones here. We showed the DNA. We show everything. So, you know what? Believe what you want to believe, brother. Just live right. right and treat.